Hi Aries, welcome to your reading Aries. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. What spirit wants you to know Aries? Aries, this is a collective message for your sign. Sun, Moon, Rising, Ven Venus and North Node. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your overall situation, Aries. Let's see, what do we have for you, Aries? Let's see. Uh -huh. Okay, we have conflict and next to it, apology. So if you are conflicted with someone or there was an argument between you and someone else, you can expect that uh, this person here it's coming with an apology they want to say sorry they want to make amends okay so it looks like this conflict uh, will find its positive resolution oh wow well. okay we have intuition and spying aries um we have universe we have commitment and at the bottom of the deck, we have a water sign. Okay. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries. You might be dealing with those signs. Listen to your intuition. You are very intuitive at the moment, Aries. Answers are within reach. Reflect on something here. That's what uh, they're giving me here. They're giving me that there might be a need for you to reflect on certain situation okay but at the end of the day listen to your inner voice because you're divinely guided we have a universe card so trust in the universe right this energy and we have also divine timing something here will happen in in a right in in a in a precise way and in a right time because divine timing is it it, it it represents this energy that something you might feel that something is taking for a long time or nothing is happening however uh, divine timing is there to kind of sh uh, reassure you that uh, things actually happening behind the scenes it might be difficult for you to kind of notice them but but something here it's working to your advantage and it will manifest in a precise right time okay so trust in the process trust uh, in the universe we have commitment so someone here wants a higher level of commitment it might be a water sign doesn't have to be but it might be we have Pisces Cancer Scorpio I'm getting very strongly that it might be a case that this water sign it's spying on you they are looking at your social media they are, they are trying to figure out what you're up to what's going on in your life they are very curious about you someone indeed for sure it's very curious let's see let's see what do we have for Aries what do we have for Aries spirit Page of Wands, communication, it's coming, Aries, Aries, the lovers, so someone indeed wants a higher level of commitment, Five of Wands, that's the card of conflict that we have, King of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Wheel of Fortune and the Lovers. Oh my gosh. Look, w because this particular deck, I will, I will put, um, I will list this deck uh, in the description box below, Aries. And actually on the community page, I will send the photo. This is a Titanic, uh, Risen spirits, that's the deck. And in this particular deck, we have two cards of lovers. And look how incredible what they're showing us here. Is we're starting with the lovers. It's like this gentleman here is asking this lady, uh, 
I'm getting maybe a proposal, you know, like an engagement, or they this this person here is making an offer, right? And we are ending actually with a kiss. And we have this commitment card. So um Wow. <laughs> but this, this particular deck has two lovers cards, which I think they are very beautiful because they are like building the story. So you might be dealing with Gemini, Aries. I have very strong Gemini here. And I also have fixed energy, Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, Leo. Okay. I'm getting... Uh, that indeed it might be a case that someone here sabotaged a certain connection okay this king of pentacles you might be dealing with an earth sign actually um, I see you that you share a very strong connection with someone with the lovers but with the five of swords something here didn't work out or this king of pentacles they sabotaged this connection they created conflict drama if that's the case for for instance for now it might be a situation that you are in no contact uh, that there is no contact between the two of you with the knight of pentacles because this is the slowest moving knight so it might feel that this for them to come forward and apologize it's taken forever however they will because we have a will of fortune so we have a complete change of circumstances and look what it's after this will of fortune we have the lovers but it is like reconciliation you have essentially here uh, a story and if you resonate with the story that it's your story here Aries I'm getting very strongly that you share very strong soul connection with someone for some of you relationship with the lovers but this person here lied or you they created conflict arguments uh, they played some sort of mind games I get very strongly someone who might be quite stuck in their head they have tendency to over analyzing overthinking certain matters and they created conflict with the five with the five of swords it might be a case that you felt that this person played you but they are coming here. They are coming because they want to change the circumstances that your connection might be in at the moment. They want reconciliation with the lovers. They want higher level of commitment. With the nine of wands at the bottom of the deck, Aries, I'm seeing you having reservation. I mean reservations towards this, with regards to this, this situation. It's like you are not fully... You're not fully, I don't know, you don't trust this situation because of what this person did, represented by the Five of Swords. But it feels like they truly want to reconcile. And this reconciliation here, reunion, it's very much possible. This is a higher level of commitment. Let's clarify the reading here, Aries. Why the lovers? Queen of Wands, the magician. It feels like there was or there that there was an interference, uh, like an outside uh, interference of some sort. Queen of Wands represent third party situation. Doesn't have to be, but with the magician, it's like yeah, someone here, uh, and I feel this is a another person. They created, it might be gossip, you know, something like this. They've acted in a, in a not particularly nice way. Nine of Wands again. Yeah, you don't trust this person. If, if that's the case, you know exactly who I'm talking about and what sort of situation that is. I'm getting like someone here 
it's like a third party interference and it can be i'm getting very strong uh, female energy it can be a mother it can be grandmother auntie sister colleague friend or this person put you in a third party situation therefore they got very easy distracted but with the magician you also might be dealing here aries with virgo gemini i'm also um, what i'm getting is that this person this queen of wands whatever she might signify for you, to you um she, whatever she might signify to you uh, <laughs> um, it just represents someone who said something because magician it's an action orientated card and and next to this energy it's like someone tricked someone this 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 king of pentacles male female please take it how it resonates into believing something and i feel that it was not true it's like they convinced them to do something here with the magician they use all their skills this is someone who is very skillful with their words and they created that sort of situation why the five of swords why the five of swords for Aries? nine of pentacles and five of pentacles i feel aries that <sighs> there will be a change we have double five okay so changes on the horizon at the moment i feel aries that you are minding your own business you're keeping your head very high um it's like you don't want to give someone satisfaction you know that kind of give me that sort of kind of vibe but deeply inside i feel that you are emotionally hurt you are disappointed it's like someone refused to take into consideration your side of the story or your point of view and it feels like you you've been judged unfairly but with the nine of pentacles uh, this someone here sees you as you're doing all right that you minding your own business yes this is a love related situation we have a two of cups it's yeah someone here said something represented by this queen of wands and it caused a conflict between you and someone who is very close to your heart indeed there, you might you might have been in relationship with this person and it's like you know with this nine of pentacles i feel that you know you made the decision i'm not going to chase this person what i was about to say i said i've explained they refuse to take into consideration my and uh, my point of view and i feel you are you are disappointed deeply inside you are very disappointed because five of pentacles is this energy of being left out in the cold no support no understanding but um you decided i feel that you d you made the decision that no you are not going to make any moves here that if this person wants to balance things out with you they will have to approach you because it might be a case that you, i feel that you are perfectly aware what happened here and you know that this person was played but also you might feel that there is this sense of emotional betrayal because they they decided to for instance maybe even believe another person rather than you something like this is showing up but this is a love related matter why the king of pentacles that's what they suggesting queen of pentacles we have an eight of cups yeah someone walked away someone walked away you share very strong soul connection with this person here aries that gives me a kind of a soulmate vibe someone here said something did and they tried very hard to bring some sort of doubt to create conflict between you and and another person someone was to face and it ended i feel that this person or you walked away because we have someone walking away with the eight of cups knight of pentacles please why the knight of pentacles why the knight of pentacles please why 
the Knight of Pentacles, please. The Aries. We have the Emperor. And we have King of Souls. That's your energy, Aries. With this Emperor. Yeah. You are taking back control here. I'm getting very strongly that someone really wants to talk to you. Nine of Cups. I'm getting, Aries, that both of you are quite proud. It looks like a huge misunderstanding to me. But um, that Emperor here, you might be dealing with another Aries as well. Uh, really wants to talk they want to clear the air with you but it feels like taking so long for them to come forward they are very unhappy at the moment they are missing you why the will of fortune there is Six of Pentacles and the Hanged Man. You might be dealing with Pisces. The Fool, yes, this person is changing perspective about the whole situation here. I feel that this person regrets being quite listening to someone else, essentially giving attention to someone else. And with the Hanged Man, it's like they are changing perspective here. And we have the fall. So they want to come back around, Aries. That's also your energy. You might be dealing also with Aquarius. Someone is, 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 is kind of, it's getting, what I'm seeing here that someone um, finally understands that, that they judged a certain situation. They judged you. In a wrong way and it's all because there was the interference of the third party someone said something rumors they tried very hard with this magician very very hard to influence this this your connection with this person but they are changing perspective here why the lovers at the end This is a love reading, Aries. Why the lovers? Queen of Cups. Hierophant. Commitment. High level of commitment. Seven of Cups. This person here is coming, Aries. And they want a higher level of commitment with you. You might be dealing with Taurus. Because they have love for you. And we have this water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, here in your outcome, Aries. It feels like this situation will be healed and this misunderstanding indeed will find its positive resolution because we have someone, this person, coming with an apology. They are coming with an apology. This person is it's realizing that they should that they should have not listened to, uh, to to this other individual they confused them they confused them for some of you this this person where they will show up they will just say very very clearly that they want higher level of commitment that they won't take this connection into the next level for some of you it might be a case that they will say can we be official maybe even propose just saying <laughs> but overall Aries if you resonate with this with this with this reading you can be reassured here that uh, if there is a no contact situation between you and this person they are coming back with an apology and kind of they will ask if you can be together with the seven of cups I feel that you know you will think about it but you will make your decision Therefore, for some of you, if you really want to reconcile with this person, 
Absolutely. This is someone who has feelings for you. They want higher level of commitment. So they are coming with an apology. It just depends if you, if you're willing to accept the apology. But uh, something like this, it, it's going to happen fairly soon. Aries, this person, it's coming. I feel that you will have a chance to talk about the situation. And I also getting this kind of conversation when you might say, but I've had completely different story here. This is not this is not what this person told me or this is not what I've heard. Mm -hmm. Confusion. Someone confused both of you, especially your person here, Aries, on purpose. Stara, someone someone did something here on purpose to part you, to part both of you. But it seems that uh, at the end you will reconcile with each other. This is someone who loves you, that your, your person here, Aries. And they will come with an offer of higher level of commitment. Aries, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly appreciate you. Aries, have a fantastic and wonderful day. And once again, thank you very, very much for being with me. Take care. Bye.